Hey guys, it's me, Geeky Summer. So, lately I have been trying to post for you guys, but it hasn't really gone so well because I just haven't really had time lately. And so, today I'm home alone, so I thought, you know what, my YouTube subscribers need the next Let's Play update. So, I am recording right now, Let's Play The Sims 3. University Part 2. <laughs> it's so weird to think that I'm recording a Let's Play because I haven't been able to record a Let's Play in five months. <laughs> and so, yeah, let's just hop right in. Also, before I start, I shouldn't have said that. <laughs> um, I have a Twitter account, so if you guys have Twitter, go follow it. I put it in the link down below. And I might be making a email account so that you guys can email me through that if you are a YouTuber and you want to do a collab because I love to do collabs with other YouTubers I just love contacting YouTubers and so if you guys wanna give me suggestions but you don't want to comment on my videos or you're another YouTuber and you want to do a collab just hit me up once I make that. I will post it on Twitter and tell you when I make that through my next video. So, let's hop right in. So, we recently moved to um, the university campus. Sorry if my game is laggy. It's annoying me. Ugh, sorry, guys. My game lags so much when I first go into it. So, hopefully it doesn't lag too much. <sighs> Sorry guys, this is going to annoy me. But yes, we moved to the campus for the sims that we are playing, which, to review, we have Dominique Rucker, Damon Hempfield, and Daryl Tanner. So, I last in the last part, I edited up their rooms. And we um, just kind of got them ready for their first day officially in the house. So I will show you the rooms quick just because I know last time I think they got kind of cut off when I was showing you guys. So this is Dominique's and her roommate's room, which is just going to be... Um, a certain girl, I don't remember what her name is, but I'm not going to go into detail because she's not going to really be that important unless we're, like, best friends with her. <laughs> and then across the hall is the boys' room. It's still kind of the same as when it was built. I didn't really change it up much because boys don't really decorate their room unless it's with a bunch of posters. And in the, post the posters in The Sims 3 aren't really the best posters and so I just don't really put posters on my wall unless it's like the decorative stuff for girls but anyways so I'm not going to be decorating the dorm because I kind of don't decorate the dorm unless I really want to like if it gets really bad then I don't but I don't yeah I'm just not going to waste my time and the money to decorate a dorm that we're going to be in for what two semesters so it's like there'd be no point that's a waste of money that our sims could have and why is daryl in his underwear and a sweatshirt <laughs> that's a great way to start an lp just yeah daryl's in his underwear <laughs> so we're gonna put daryl in some normal clothes because buddy i get it you want to be in your uh boxers but you're on YouTube right now. You don't really need to be. Kind of gonna awkward out our fans here, eh? <laughs> so, I put him back in his everyday clothes. So, let's get started. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Sorry, guys. My throat has been killing me lately, and it's annoying me because I'm like, I want to record for you guys. 
Okay, so it says living in a dorm, living in dorms. Now that you have arrived, you may want to take a minute to select the bedroom you want to claim and decorate your room. Don't forget to set the lock options on your door if you prefer to not. Or, uh, <laughs> don't forget to set the lock options on your door if you prefer to keep out visitors. Since we already did that in the last part, I think my game just glitched out, and they're like. Yo, you didn't do this last time. You should probably do this. And I'm like, Haha, I actually did do it. Thank you very much. <laughs> Sorry, guys. I get really weird when I'm playing The Sims. It's just my nature. What's the matter, Daryl? <clears throat> so, we are going to cancel out that. No, we're not going to get a logo. No, I'm... God, Sims get so annoying when they're like, Wanna meet a local? I wanna go travel. It's like you're not gonna go travel. Just no. Just no. So what is what is he doing? Oh, he's playing computer games. That's the I guess we'll just kind of let them explore. And I mean we might have them meet with their friends just because it feels like you never have enough roommates. It just feels like you never have enough roommates. What is he doing? What is Daryl doing? He's just, like, sitting in places. What is this boy's problem? We're gonna have you, like, do something. Like, he's just being weird today. Which is very odd. We'll just have you study because you are a nerd, basically. You are a nerd bird of the group. And then we got the rebel here, Raymond. Raymond the rebel kind of goes together, except he's gaining nerd points right now. You know. Got them rebels somehow. <laughs> so, yeah, we're just going to kind of have him meet people. So, he, right now, Dominique is right now talking to... A Nucky Moon, who's a jock. And then, um, a Sela Karma. I don't know, I mean, we might want to friendly introduce ourselves to everybody so that we can just have a wide variety of people to talk to. So, we're gonna have Dominique kind of get buddy-buddy with some of her, um, roommates. Just to kind of, you know, oh, well, apparently we're getting hit on in the first five minutes of the oh, yeah. LP here. <laughs> so, Asayla yes. here, uh, <laughs> she, when our students started talking to her, she said, yeah. I don't care what anyone else thinks, <laughs> I think you're <laughs> hot. <laughs> so, <laughs> apparently Asayla is lesbian, but no biggie there, because... I love everybody. I just don't think Dominique likes women. <laughs> so there's probably a problem. Sorry, Asayla, but I guess it's a no. <laughs> so I guess you're going to have to go find another girl because, yeah, we're not interested. Sorry. <laughs> so, uh, let's see. This boy wants to wear an learn some writing skills. So, I mean, I guess we could have him practice his writing. Um, <clears throat> sorry guys, my throat is killing me right now. Ugh, this is gonna annoy me through the whole LP. Um, speaking of writing, and we're getting hit on again. Well then, that's two in one day. Score for us, apparently. Too bad it's not the boys getting hit on. <laughs> so, I think there's only, like, one girl left in the house. Yeah, there's one girl and, like, two boys. Whoa, sister. There's a fight up in here. There's a fight going on right here. This bastard is just standing there. Jeez, drama. Already. <laughs> um, but speaking of writing, so... I'm gonna hold off on change for a little bit. I know in my update, I said I would try to have it up by the, um, by Thanksgiving break. It's just hard to get it done when I have a busy schedule. So, 
I don't really Jenny, know. I'm gonna probably postpone it till. I don't want to say February, so probably mid January, so I can get ahead more because it's just not going so well from what I wanted to do. But I promise you guys, I will get episodes put ahead of time so I can just upload it and not have to worry about. Oh crap, I don't get the next episode ready. What am I gonna do? My subscribers are gonna hate me. And so, yeah, I am going to get episodes done ahead. I'm gonna just postpone change till mid January because I just don't want you guys to be like, well, you said you were gonna do it in before Thanksgiving break. And I know I said I would try. It's just hard, you know, with my schedule and stuff, and then having to keep on top of YouTube, and so yeah, it's just a lot of work for that, but right now, our Sims are going to the University Meet and Greet, so yeah, we're just gonna fast forward there. Okay, so our Sims have finally made it here, and it's kind of a cool little place. I think this is where they go to get their lectures done, like right here. I know they get lectures done. He's even a buffet. <laughs> food time. <laughs> sorry guys, I crave a lot of food. So, sorry guys if you just saw the update. God, I hate my computer sometimes. Um, so yeah, we are gonna have them get some freebies, cause, you know, get them freebies and then we can, uh, so it says, this is a letter from the school, or from the university, I should say, saying, congratulations on your accept uh, acceptance to Sims University. Rewarding, successful careers await you. With the best jobs going to graduate with the highest grades. So how do I earn good grades, you ask? Good question. Or high grades, you ask? Good question. I cannot talk today. <laughs> um, regardless of how many classes you take, you'll earn one comprehensive, comprehensive uh, grade for the entire term, and it's based primarily on your exam scores. So that means go do good in school, kids, and get your grades up high by doing tests. It's the true key. <laughs> um... To do well in your exams, your academic performance should be as high as possible when you take the exam. Being in a good mood and getting a good night's sleep wouldn't hurt either. Sorry guys, get my phone blown up. <laughs> um, should be as high as possible when you take that and get be in a good mood and good night's sleep won't hurt either. Academic performance is increased by going to class, attending lectures, and participating in outside class activities and studies. You have also been given a special study object related to your specific major, a very useful tool for building academic performance. Classes begin tomorrow, and you are held every Monday and Wednesday. Tuesday and Thursdays are for outside class activities and attending lectures in the student union building. On Friday, you'll go back to the classroom to take exams. Refer to the academic panel on your schedule, grades, and other information. When you're here to earn a, you're here to earn a degree, but be sure you enjoy yourself too. Welcome to Sims University. So that was just basically an introduction to that. So I guess we're kind of just gonna walk around. Who's this guy? We got a kind of cutie over here. Maybe we should get Dominique over here and work her magic, you know. Get us some guys to know. I guess we're just gonna kind of have her meet people. Because if we ever meet people, then, like, we can just kind of, you know, we got a hit. We got a hit, guys. It's a good thing. And it's not a lesbian this time, which is pretty nice. Because love them to death, but we're not interested. Ooh, he also thinks we're hot. Ugh. The nerd thinks we're hot. That's not good. We were invited to a party. Let's attend that party. Oh, it's even a juice cake party. So Paris Vanderbilt 
invited Daryl to a sweet juice cake party. Is Daryl ready to party down? It's on Sunday at 5.42 p.m. The dress code is swimwear. And the location, don't really care because I don't understand oh. some growth. So, oh. we are good there. <laughs> oh. So, we'll attend the party. Where is Raymond? He's right now working on his science. And so is Daryl. Daryl's doing his radio. Why are you guys messing with that stuff? Okay, I think I'm just gonna send Daryl and Raymond home. Because they don't really need to be here right now if they're just gonna use their stuff. So, we are gonna have them go home, those two. But we are gonna... Have Dominique meet more people. Oh, great. Another hit. And as a lesbian. We're screwed, aren't we? She might just have to turn lesbian. Sorry, girls. I know Dominique probably was going to be like, oh my gosh, she's going to be like gorgeous and she's going to like fall in love with the cutest guy ever. Yeah, no, apparently she's lesbian because she's getting hit on so many times. It's crazy. We've had like, what, four or five hits in the past hour? <laughs> Not Seriously, Master. everybody's in on her. What's the big deal? Ooh. Apparently, they think she's Ooh. like smoking Ooh. hot, smoking hot up in the room. <laughs> Sorry, guys, I get really weird. So we are just going to see the boys. So I think I'm gonna place their um, study stuff in their room. I mean, we kind of have room for it. Look, just so it's there. I guess we could fit their stuff there and there. Sorry, guys, trying to figure out room for their stuff. Because they got the things now. So it's like, oh, well, crap, you're going to need that. <laughs> so we will put Raymond's in this corner. And then we will try to fit Daryl's radio thing. Left it right there. Yay, it fits. Okay, so we have right now Daryl and Raymond's thing. So he wants to acquire Elixir, but he kind of needs to be in science. So I think I'm going to have... Why did I zoom out so fast? <laughs> so we are going to have him just continue. He's going to start a book because, you know, Sims could get... He could maybe, you know, write a book about elixir and alchemy, you know. Never know, bro. <laughs> so, we're going to do that. And then, I think I'll just have him. Let's see, is there any needs? He has social needs. God, he must be a social butterfly, which I wouldn't be shocked because most of my sins are. <laughs> so, we'll just have him serve up some autumn salad. And, you know, Bail or Tiffany... Kind of a cutie, so we are going to have Raymond work his magic, you know, maybe flirt it up a little bit. Can't hurt, right? <laughs> what doesn't kill you make you stronger, so we're just going to go with it. <laughs> so we are going to have Raymond talk to Tiffany downstairs, and then we will have Daryl go write his book, and we will focus on Dominique here. Because she is right now in the... Sims Corridor or Sims uh, University thing. Uh, should we play Juice Pong or Tennis? Let's do Juice Pong. <laughs> Ooh, sure. I don't care what the name is. Let's do Muggsy. Let's play a round of uh, Juice Pong with Muggsy. You know, the cutie kind of is uh, very attractive, so we will have her flirt it up a bit. If you know what I mean. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. You get what I mean. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he also. Well, oh. <laughs> 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 oh, nice girl. Just like, yeah, you're gonna be drawn by the end of the night. <laughs> so, they're kind of cute together. 
How about in the comments below, you guys tell me if I should continue this relationship? You know, make them good friends, and then they have a little fun, they can start dating. Because I think they'd be cute together. They're just, like, they're cute together, in my mind. Like, I don't know why, they just seem so cute together. See? Now once we find Daryl and Raymond and date, we'll just go on a triple date, you know? Uh, I'm like really interested in these two right now. I don't know why, they're just so cute. <laughs> she lost. Okay, so we are gonna have Dominique go home, sadly. But, you know, we'll keep in touch with Muggsy. I think he's still in our panel. Oh, Raymond, you get in your ass. Flirt on. Why don't you? We are going to have a joke about professors, make silly faces, show some funny videos, show some gross videos, cat videos, you know, the normal to, you know, get your friends shipped up, which I gotta say, showing a cute cat video isn't too bad. <laughs> so, we are gonna have him be funny and get with her. And you know, Daryl, the boring guy he is, is just sitting down writing his book. Which is probably a good idea for me to write the scripts and stuff for the change, but we won't <laughs> And I think I just saw Dominique come in. Yeah, he is coming in. Ooh, they gotta attend the party. Somebody's excited. Is she getting test on right now? She's getting test on right now. That's pretty odd. <laughs> he's so boring. Because he's just like sitting here. So we're gonna have him stop. <laughs> So now he is a amateur gamer within the nerd social group. <laughs> so, Raymond's a nerd. Okay, I went take him for a nerd, but oh, he is. Uh, um. So I'm guessing you're not going. He's gonna talk to himself now. Oh, you crazy kid. Evil Lord. Don't be sense. What is going on here? Is he having a fight with himself? That's, uh, uh, that's a He's just enough. talking to himself. Block Super Naka! What huh. the heck are we witnessing right now, guys? Ayawa. He's like uh, Banubi. arguing Banubi. slash trying to calm himself down. Like, what the heck? And then he just goes back home. He's like, you know what? There ain't gonna be no party. He lost a friend. What did you oh, say? Sobidan Chibaru. Hmm. Raymond, you're screwing up your shots, man. Let's just ask about her day. Ask about her day. Ask about game. Ask about age. Ask about game. Ask her gender preference, because from what we know, she could be well, newbie, lesbian. Cause Numa, we. <laughs> she is like every single girl is hitting on Dominique, so we don't know if she is straight or <laughs> not. Mm. So, yeah, we will just leave them alone, and she's coming home now. So, eat. She's pretty hungry too. She's 12 days old, or 12 days younger than Raymond. So we're gonna have her go eat some autumn salad because that's some good stuff. So yeah, I think I will continue the part when they started their first day of class. I know this part was kind of boring. I just think. I needed to get another part out for you guys because it didn't seem fair that I like took two weeks or something from the last LP. 
So, yeah, I will hopefully get this posted tonight. Not for sure. But, yeah, guys. So, I'm going to end the part here. And I will try my hardest. I'm not going to promise anything. To record Ambitions Part 2. And get them both uploaded tonight, hopefully. Um, if I don't, I will try to record when I can. It should be maybe next week I'll try to record. And also, I am doing a Geeky Collab. If you know who I am collabing with, that is great. If you don't, you need to check Twitter because me and this Simmer have been talking about it for a day now. And I'm pretty soaked. So, yeah, guys. I'm going to end right here. So, I love all you geeks. And I want you guys to have a wonderful day. Thank you, guys.